the object of experiment number two is to study operating characteristics of type B and type C miniature circuit breaker, in short MCB. Second is to draw the current time and temperature time characteristics. Third is to study operating characteristics of HRC fuse using a draw current time curve. So before diving into this experiment, it is suggested that you go through the theory part so shown over here is the, uh, the testing system for the MCB and HRC fuse and the NVIS 7090. And if you look into this, the panel of this system, you, you see that there is a variac provided on the panel, then certain terminals connected to rheostat, then switches. Then you have the terminals for connecting to the display or the ammeter, which is shown here. So this display will be showing you the current temperature and time. While here you see a knob that is that is required to switch to the the component under test. For example, if you're going to test the type B MCB, then you'll be switching this knob at the topmost option. While in the middle, the middle option shows type C MCB, and the bottom option sh uh, shows the testing of fuse. So the purpose of this knob is only to change the uh, name of the component on the display. For example, if you see the display, you see MCBC, since this knob is connected at C terminal. If you make, if you select the uh, B type MCB, then you will simply see MCBB. If you select using this knob fuse, then you will be seeing HRC here. So here is the type B MCB, while this is the type C MCB, and this is the HRC fuse. So these three components will be tested using this system. So shown at the bottom right side is the circuit diagram and the connections that will have to be done. So we have a rheostat external to the system connected at the between these two terminals. Then the, these two terminals three and four are connected to the ammeter terminals. And then you have the output from the variac connected to the component under test. So if you're going to test, for example, uh, type BMCB, then you will be connecting these two terminals to the terminals of the type 2, type BMCB. Likewise, if you want to test type CMCB, you will be rather connecting these two terminals to type C. And likewise, if you test the fuse, then you will have to connect these two terminals uh, to the fuse instead. So you have MCB type B with a specification or rated current as 6 ampere, then type C MCB has a rated current of 2 ampere, the HRC fuse uses a current of maximum 6 ampere. Then you have a uh, rheostat which is which can be varied to a maximum of 220 ohms and has a rated current of 2.8 amperes. So shown on the leftmost side is the connection that had been done using the circuit diagram shown. Now we'll be performing experiment testing type B and CB. So we'll be taking four readings starting from 8 ampere, then 9 ampere and so on. And for shown over here is the test corresponding to current taken as 9 ampere. We'll be trying to maintain this current at 9 ampere using rheostat and observe the time when the, uh, this MCB operates. The temperature is also shown. So we'll be noting down the current the time it takes to operate and the temperature of the MCB. So this is the first set of reading and in a similar way for different values of current we'll be obtaining different set of readings as shown. Now in this case we'll be testing the type C MCB. So the terminals as uh, shown in the figure are changed and connected to type B MCB, type C MCB. And now we'll maintain the current around 4 amperes for this type of MCB.
So the current is maintained using the rheostat. So the MCB trips at 42.81 uh, seconds and then likewise we'll be taking a different set of readings for different values of current at 5 ampere, 6 ampere and 7 amperes. So we observed that the time the MCB takes will reduce. Likewise we'll be testing the HRC fuse and we'll be observing the time that the HRC fuse takes at different uh, values of current. So and uh, we have connected the terminals to the HRC fuse and in fact what in this experiment are we going to do since you all know that the fuse uh, can be used only once and thus the fuse when uh, the the fuse will be blown and will be tripping the circuit so it cannot be reused so here the fuse blows and we obtain a reading of uh, the time it takes is around 27.07 seconds at current of 10 ampere and similarly we can have different set of readings for different values of current and that will require different uh, that will require multiple HRC fuse so we performed only one reading uh, using the HRC fuse because of the limited number of such fuse we have we will have to write a report uh, discussing the following questions.